What's up YouTube, welcome back to another CGH video. In today's video, I'm gonna go over a few things. So in a couple of my videos, I got a lot of comments telling me that what you wear in GTA Online affects your health. Like if you wear a t-shirt, your health will be different than if you were wearing a utility vest or bodyguard armor. There were a lot of comments calling some of my tests inaccurate because of the clothing someone was wearing. Now I'm gonna do a little bit of myth busting. So the myth is that if you wear your heavy utility vest or any sort of heavy armor, you can take more shots. I don't know why that is, it's, it's certainly not true. As you can see here, I'm using the advanced rifle and the special carbine. Both regularly with like, if you're just wearing a t-shirt, it's gonna kill you in 10 shots with the advanced rifle and 11 shots with the special carbine. Even if the weapon was suppressed, it would still take 10 shots with the advanced rifle and 11 shots with the special carbine. So then I tested the utility vest, bodyguard armor, and they all came out the same. The only piece of clothing that actually does some sort of protection is a bulletproof helmet. The bulletproof helmet will allow you to take up to three shots to the head compared to one shot if you weren't wearing a helmet. The only other way of getting wearable protection would be buying armor from ammunition. This armor will allow you to take up to three more shots from the advanced rifle and two more shots from the special carbine. A lot of people won't resort to this because it does cost money every time you use armor and someone could easily just shoot it off you with two or three bullets. I guess the only situation in which your health actually changes with what you're wearing would be like in a heist. If you wear one of the special utility vests, you are able to take more shots in heist, but you actually run slower. Now I know a lot of you already know this information, but I wanted to make a quick video just to clear things up. I also want to thank Tails for helping out in this video. His Twitch will be down in the description below. I'm sorry if this is a really short video. I just wanted to discuss this quick topic. I didn't want to spend 10 minutes talking on one pointer like most YouTubers these days. If you do have any questions, feel free to leave them down in the comment section below. And if you liked this video or found it informative in any way, be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. Feel free to browse the channel. I have tons of videos you may enjoy. Thank you so much for watching and for everything gaming, you know where to find it, right here at CGH. Uh, the best living or dead hands down, huh? Let's talk more here right now, huh?